All right, here we are at the Tanner Gun Show. Right now, we're working with Knives with Brad. Brad earlier today sent me a picture of a pretty naked table who's out of product. How you doing, Brad? Hey, I'm doing really good. How good. are you doing, I'm James? doing good. Well, as a matter of fact, I saw that picture you sent me. I see that. And I brought you some goodies. Brought me goodies. There so, you go. Yep. There you go. How's your day, bud? You know, it's been really good. It's been really good. And it must be if I'm out of some of the sharpeners. I mean, uh, look at this. This, right is, now, this is what you have to offer people right now. Yeah, right now, that was it. That was the whole ball of wax. I was just going to say that does not represent Sharpen's Best, but I guess that does represent Sharpen's Best because everybody wants one. That's right. Everybody wants one. I want right. one, too. See, that's a whole lot better. What are, what are you doing right now? Well, uh, this young lady was told by her dad. Hi, young lady. Have me Hi. <laughs> sharpen uh, her knife for her. Right. So we're just putting a little bit of sharp on it taking some of the nicks out of the cutting edge and that knife has actually been used kind of hard which is okay but that, there's definitely some little problems that's a real knife that's right a cool knife that's, yep that's a daily user right there yes just like that now let's see Woo. oh she's gonna be happy about that's that actually sharp enough it, if it'll catch you take the fingernail off that's sharp enough. Where you at? What are you doing today? What are you, it's been a good day, obviously. It has been, thank you. Well, I'm at the Tanner Gun Show, okay? And um, I'm trying to think, uh, oh, no, I, I, a 70 and... Uh, chambers, Chambers and I-70. Chambers, Chambers and I-70 on the north side of uh, 70 and about, I don't know, two or three blocks, maybe something like that, two blocks. And uh, it's a really good show. It's a good venue. And um, we're in a, uh, a hotel uh, convention real, real center. Real quick, we're going to do a look here. It's big. Now, let's scoot back around. So we're in Denver at the Crown Plaza, all right, convention center. It's been a really good show. And uh, a I, lot I, of I had to people. bring you what, you, what you, what do we have now to sell okay, for tomorrow's? Well, we got the Sharp and Spark minis, and I've got just a few of those left. And then uh, we got the Sharp and Spark, got the Mini. Mini, And this would be Sharp and Spark. The original. Yeah. Uh, Everybody's favorite. Every... Those boxes confuse me too. Okay. It's actually a little lip. Well, you just gotta, you gotta find it. Gotta, there it is. Oh, okay. Yeah, it's, <laughs> it's like, okay, how do you get in? Oh, uh, those so, are pretty. So then we have the Sharp and Spark. Now there's going to be some people that might come by and say, you lied to me, you said you didn't have any more. So I'll definitely have to tell them, hey, I got some boxes, I uh, got some more product, you know. So now we fill up a tray, and that tray was completely full. And so we just take the tray, and we fill it up like this. <laughs> and we put it back out there in front of all the people, there's 25 of these sharpeners in each one of these back boxes, and then 30 of the Sharp and Spark Mini in those boxes. Okay? So, we fill this one up. It's been a good show, a lot of sharpening, and um, just a lot of good customers and stuff. A lot of repeat customers. I get a lot of repeat customers. Because once they figure out they really work, they come back and they buy more for their family members. They bring family members. I sell a lot of sharpeners to people who've been buying my sharpeners for 15 years. And uh, so that's good. And uh, uh, that's 25. When I started this show this weekend, that was heaped. Uh, and they're all gone. I would like to see you sell out of those again, uh, if you could yeah. for me, please, Brad. Right. And if not, they can always go online. They can go online. www.sharpensbest.com oh. and watch the life and style of Brad Buckner. Look at that. A little while ago, a guy come by and he looked at me and goes, I've seen you on YouTube. And I said, doing what? And he said, sharpening knives. <laughs> And he said, I can't believe, now I'm actually standing here looking at the guy that I was watching on YouTube. So that's pretty cool. Awesome. You know? I'm glad you're having a good day, and it's going to be even better tomorrow, Brad. Good to see you, bud. All right. You take care. Stay sharp out there. Yeah, this, 